Okay guys, welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda's Minish Cap. Um, let's see what's up here. My chest. Whoa. <coughs> 50 rupees that we can't use. Wow. I'm not sure if you can go over a thousand in this game. I'm pretty sure the most is 999. But whatever, I've been wrong before. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm, I don't know, my throat's kind of being stupid today. Um, apparently this, this puzzle is here to hit that switch. Um, geez, I'm freaking pretty hard. What? Oh, I thought that was gonna hit it. Um, crap, I think I messed up. Damn it, you can't grab them either. Jeez. Um, uh, let's see, maybe. Maybe the, the watery spots stop the ice. From going. Stop it. Um. Nope, they just go on forever. Oh well. Um. Yeah, they just go on forever. Um. Let's just go to the other side. Let's see what's over there. Whoop. Went too far down. Okay. Jeez. God. The water's just as bad as the freaking ice. Oh man, you can't even go over there. Alright, let's go down and go forward. Die. Alright, jeez. Oh, mini boss. So what this does? This is actually the mini boss you guys missed last time when I said that uh, I accidentally fought a mini boss and then I got the jar. This is that same mini boss. So I guess you guys didn't miss out. <laughs> Jeez, that was like epic episode three or something. Okay, let's go through the door. Oh. Okay, what's in here? A compass. Okay. Um, let's actually use that for once. Oh, dude, I missed treasures on the first floor. Um, let's see if I can go get those. <coughs> Give my mind some time to think about those stupid puzzles. I bet it's something really easy that I'm just not getting. Man. I hope it's not something stupid. That would really make me mad. Wait. I'm just gonna see what's over here without the... God, I wish I could get this puzzle. Wait, I think I see it. Um, yeah, I think I see it. Okay, so you push this down. Stop it, stupid bugs. Okay. Jeez, I almost... Okay, you push this... Oh, jeez. <laughs> God, stop sliding around. You push this down. Then... You push this next to it. Let me push this up. Wait a minute. <coughs> I just screwed myself over again. Jeez. Man. 
Okay. We'll just leave the leaf um the leaf pad here. Let's see if it resets. I'm pretty sure it does reset. <coughs> is the leaf pad still over here? Yes it is. Stop. Get out of my way. Okay, wait, let's see what's over here first. An ice chest, are you kidding me? We can't even do anything about that now, so um I'm just gonna leave that because we can't do anything about it now, so might as well just forget about it. I'm gonna go see what I missed uh, upst upstairs. Oh wow! <laughs> Keep forgetting I had the gust jar on, on, and so I pushed myself back into the freaking water. There's a treasure chest there. Uh, let's see how you get in there. There's a door right there. No, that's the wrong way. Um, how did I miss that chest? I was like right where I came from. Jeez, I must have not been paying attention at all. that I can't do anything with. And we got the map. Alright. This is actually kind of helpful. <laughs> I mean, I don't usually use the maps in um, uh, temples because, I don't know, I just seem to find my way sometimes. And this isn't the right way. You have to actually figure out that puzzle? That sucks. There's chests over there, but I can't get those. Dude, is that a passageway down there? Wait a minute, is there something behind this waterfall? Ruby, wow. <sighs> Let's just get on the lily pad. Because I'm pretty sure if you come over here, the other one from over there disappears. I'm sorry if I sound kind of, um... Lame, I guess, today. It's just that... I don't feel so good today, and so, yeah. I love that when he takes falls like that, he doesn't get hurt, but when he's little and he takes a fall into a little hole thing, he takes damage. It's kind of stupid, but whatever. John, you jerk! Stupid pillar thing. Alright, let's go. <laughs> In the immortal words of Mario, let's go. Or let's go, I don't know. I used to think that he said Mexico <laughs> when I was little. I was like, what? Mexico? That's where, that's where my parents are from, what the hell? Why would Mario say that? Is he Mexican? I knew it. I knew someone with that much skill couldn't be Italian. No, I was kidding. <laughs> I was racist. I shouldn't say stuff like that. Okay, let's figure out this puzzle finally. I mean, come on. I'm sure you have to push this down. Um. Wait. Yeah. 
fish this over there. Sorry guys if I'm not commentating, I just really have to think about this. Do you push this up? Or? Oh, you push this down. Yeah, I see it now. I see it. You push this over here. And then you push this up. And there it is. Yeah, yeah. This is probably the hardest dungeon so far. And we can't do anything about that, so let's... Let's go this way. Oh, wow. If you leave, you have to redo the puzzle. That's really messed up. But then again, if you already have the lily pad on the side, you don't really have to do it. Ah, stop hitting me with your freaking stuff. Holy crap. Alright. What the? Sam, where are you? Are you still in the room? So dark, I can't even see you. Watch your step, I don't want you to fall. Yes, it is dark. Darker than the freaking Dark Temple in Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's kind of a evil thing for me to even mention that game. I mean, that game was the game that got me into Legend of Zelda, so. Dude, get off me. I hate these guys. It. Sorry if I skipped um, a slow dialogue, it's just that I just want to get done with this temple. <laughs> and also my throat really can't handle, you know, accents that well today. Stop it. These are probably the most annoying enemies so far. Because you can't hit them when they're facing you. You have to be a little punk and go behind them. Are you serious? It was for a war point? God. It's terrible. It's terrible. And apparently you have to turn into two of these so that you can pu push that um lever. That's kind of stupid because you have the power breaks this so shouldn't you be able to do it by yourself? Whatever. Aha! Of course, I want to forget this in summer and not the eyes. That one will be as good as ours. Yes, it will. Okay, let's go this way. I swear, the, the sooner this temple's done, the better. Pretty much done with the ice now. I mean, look at that. I completely slid past the chest. Oh, great. Uh, time for a little bit of long range. You're done. Gotcha. I'm gonna go this way. Oh crap, that was the wrong way. What the hell? Okay. Um, that's gonna be pretty difficult. Especially on ice. Oh, you almost slid into one. Jeez. Be more careful. Be more careful. Wow, I actually went the right way. <laughs> Need a key for that. Can't even get over there because we don't have that. The sun right there. I can't even press that lever. Can press this one though. I heard something, but nothing happened. What the hell? Oh, okay. That's what it did. 
<laughs> I almost expected myself to slip there, but there's no ice. I swear to God, this better be something important. If it's not a key, I'm gonna freaking get really mad. <coughs> Let's see what it is. It's a key, hell yeah. About time I started making progress in this t temple. Mm. It's all they're giving me now is freaking rupees. Okay, now that we have a key, we can go through this door. Let's see. What the hell? Um. <coughs> what the? That didn't do anything. Wait a minute. What's this? Raindrops are falling on my head. <laughs> Sorry, that was terrible. <laughs> Deja vu. We beat this guy already. What the? Oh, it's an electric chew jelly. Better be careful. Apparently, you can't suck in his jelly when he's electric. <coughs> the boomerang thing? Oh, jeez. Get the yeah. Oh, he almost got me. I wonder if the boomerang will stun him. No, apparently not. Jeez. The small ones he does stun, but I guess the big ones are too much for him. Oh, that was close. Damn it. Damn it. Last time it took us, what, three turns of this to beat him? See how long it takes us this time. Oh, jeez. Ah, him and his freaking electricity. Electricity, electricity. Sorry, I was watching a lot of Schoolhouse Rock uh, because of my freaking nieces. They love that stuff. Slash the shit out of him. Is he dead? No, he's not dead. Damn it. Stop jumping around. What do you, who do you think you are, Frogger? <laughs> Sorry. God, me and my references. What's up with that? It was an E3 reference because of, um, they were playing Frogger at the. Uh, video game orchestra thing. Yeah, you're dead. You're freaking dead. He's dead. <laughs> okay. Well, let's see what this has. This must have a dungeon item because we already found the compass on the map. You got the flame lantern. This handy item lights up the night. Press the button to turn it on and off. Alright, guys. So we did it. We found the dungeon item and we now can melt ice, I'm sure. So we'll see you next time.